um, elephant poo poo paper puff. Um, we make the paper with the elephant poo and I'm gonna take you inside and we will go see how to make um, the paper from the animal poo. And this way, um, I'm gonna take you inside. We're gonna follow the poo, go and walk around in the our outdoor museum park. Now we are at the first station, the poo shed. Yeah, here we collect many kinds of poo. You will see the first room, the horse poo. And the second room, the elephant poo. We can use everything here, making paper. Normally the paper made with fiber from the trees, right? But here we don't want to cut down the trees. We want to save the world. We want to help environment. So we use alternative fiber. Mm -hmm. In the pool, you can see a lot of fiber. We're gonna use this fiber instead of the tree. You see, these animals, they eat only grass for food, only fiber. They don't eat meat, they don't eat egg. That's why their pool, when it dry, it's not smelly at all. Mm -hmm. And also, these animals, they have bad digestive system. Whatever they eat, they use for themselves only 50% and 50% they poop out and we're gonna use this fiber for paper the second station this is we call um, the clean cleaning station uh -huh. we put the raw poo when we uh, after we get it from the first station yeah we put the raw poo in the water in the big drum like this and we leave it overnight and in the morning, we just pick up the fiber on top and we wash that fiber many times and then we put the fiber that we already washed in the big pot and we call something in the big pot is the poo soup. This process, uh, the heat will kill the germs and bacteria. We cook about six hours after we cook uh, the poop uh, in the big pot about six hours right we dry the poop uh, out of the sun and after it's completely dry move the fiber inside the shed you will see yeah this is a clean poop for this station um we call the mixing and coloring station yeah and i have the mixing machine I put some water inside, we use about 80% of the green poo and 20% you use the recycled paper. Imagine you mix them well, you do six, oh uh, no, four hours. You do four hours and you will see something soft and wet like this. Before you do the green, yeah, you will get this color, natural color. When it turns to be paper, it becomes to be like this, this color. You see, it's not so, so white, right? Because we don't put any choline, we don't put any chemical. When you want to make the color paper, you just put the 20% color recycled paper in the machine. But um, you will get uh, the pop, it's not so dark color. You have to put this thing, the food coloring, yeah, the food coloring, put, put some in the machine and mix, you will get the color. And for this station, um, you will see a lot of pool balls, many colors, they are so nice and beautiful. When we make the paper sheet, we just put the frame in mm -hmm. the water and put the pool ball in the water and just breaking up break up the ball the pool ball and spread it on the frame we're gonna make it full all in the frame make it no holes make it even when it's full all in your frame just lift up the frame from the water and take your frame outside for drying after we lift up the frame from the water we just uh, put the frame outside with the sun let the sun dry it yeah in sunny day you can get a dry paper in three or four hours this is a dry paper 
after we get it from the sun. Mm -hmm. When you want to use it, you just peel it off from the frame. Just use your fingers. Peel it off. Now we got the poop paper. All the paper that you see, this is the elephant poop. That's why we call it poo poo paper. But if you would like to write down on it, yeah, we're gonna put this paper into the rolling machine in the factory. We have it in another press. And that machine, we roll it very hard, press it very hard. Make it smooth. And then you're gonna get smooth paper. That kind we use for the books for writing. When we have the dry poo paper, we can use it for the products. You can use it for the gift bag, or you can use it for the greeting card. You see inside, we use a smooth paper for writing, yeah. and outside we use a handmade paper for decorating. <laughs>